All right, hey guys. So today I'm gonna to be taking a look at a very interesting game called Scanner Sombre. This game just released on Steam and it's a exploration adventure game. So let's go ahead and start a new game. All right, so it looks like I'm in some sort of tent and there's all my supplies. There is some beeping out here, and it is pitch black. Let's walk over here and see what this is. Looks like some sort of VR headset. And a scanner. So this scanner you can use to sort of illuminate the environment around you and we're in some sort of cave it's actually pretty interesting like seeing all the little dots and the more you hold it on a location the brighter it'll get and then pretty soon you'll see like the entire object so pretty interesting all right i guess we'll go through the cave Nobody has been as deep as this for thousands of years. I was utterly alone. No call for help would ever reach the surface. My friends all told me I was crazy. My wife couldn't understand my obsession. I had to know if the myths were true. So basically we're exploring this cave or cavern. It is very, very deep. Hopefully I'm going the right way, I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, I am. So there's a bridge. Let's go over to the other side. Aperture control. Press LB and RB to change aperture. Alright, so I can make it wider or I can make it very narrow. It's kind of cool. It's like coloring on the, on the walls. I'll just make it like a sort of a medium. I right, have to walk across the bridge. So we're pretty much walking around in like pitch darkness with this like geothermal scanner, whatever the scanner is. Uh, very like interesting game, very unique. Honestly, I think it's kind of beautiful. All the little colors, all the specks of colors. It's almost like. Um, What is that? It's almost like those like kids toys that glow in the dark. That's what it reminds me of. That you like put on your walls and stuff. Whoa. That was weird. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I don't think I'm supposed to go this way. Uh, yeah. Uh oh, what's down here? Wait, can I crouch? No, I can't crouch. Alright, so... I don't think I'm supposed to be here. Like, it looks kind of like there's something on the other side of this. But there's no way I would get over there. I don't think, anyway. So let's go ahead and go a different direction. So 
so, whoa. My scanner goes like crazy when I get near this thing. Let's go this way. Have I explored this way before? I don't think so. All right, it's widened the area so I can know where I'm going. I have no idea where I'm going. I guess we're going this way. Click the zoom. Alright. Whoa. Alright, so there's a bridge here. It looks like the bridge is out. But there's some additional bridges. Yeah, there's a bridge down there, and there's a couple bridges like on the other side. There's a lot of bridges actually. And I'm sorry if there if the game or if like the video is like lagging a little bit. Um I've been having PC problems lately with the Windows Creators update while I'm recording, but I think it's fine. It's only a moment of lag every so often. Am I supposed to go this way? I'm not sure if I'm... S I, don't th I don't think I'm supposed to go up here. But maybe. Oh, there's a staircase. It's kind of cool, like, the world is sort of revealing itself, like, as you travel along. I think it's really interesting. And if you look back, you can kind of see, like, other places you've gone to. Like, look at that, you can, like, see really far back. It's pretty cool. Alright, so now I'm up here, there's another bridge below. We'll probably have to drop down there. Maybe, yeah. We'll drop down here. Let me just look over here really fast. Okay, I don't think I can make that jump. And yeah, I'm not even gonna try. I think I'm supposed to jump down here now. Woo! Holy crap! Holy shit! <laughs> okay. Um. Okay, I, I don't know what that's about. I'm just gonna jump across. I wasn't expecting that. I did not think this was a horror game. I don't think it's a horror game, but I guess there is. They never did iron out all the glitches. But that was kind of a sort of a jump scare. Sometimes you see a sensor echoes from days earlier. Calibrations turn to ghosts. But even so, I never could explain everything I saw. Alright, I don't think I'm supposed to be okay. Alright, so apparently there's ghosts in this cave. Another item to pick up, I think. Alright, looks like we're gonna have to find our way around. I don't think I can jump across. I'm not even gonna try to do that. Alright, I think I have to walk around this ledge. Maybe? Maybe? Oh, this is kinda sketchy. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's that? What's happening? What is happening? There's, there's like two guys falling. Whoa! Whoa! 
Glitch in the system. <laughs> I sort of wonder what this game would look like for textures and stuff. Very interesting, like, style. Yeah, okay, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to make my way back and get that item on the ground. There we go. So what is this? Burst scan. Press Y to initiate burst scan. Whoa. Okay, that just revealed like the entire area. How many times can I do that? Oh, you can only do that a certain amount of times. It recharges. Oh, I should have saved it for down here. Whoa. All right, I almost have the burst scan. I have no idea how long this game is, by the way. So, this might be a never-ending cave, for all I know. But it seems like I'm going in the right direction. Let's do another burst scan. Whoa, that is really cool. Okay, so it only, like, reveals things that you can see. It doesn't reveal anything, like, further on. But it looks like I'm making my way further down. It's really cool that you can see, like, through walls and stuff. This reminds me a lot of, like, the X-Ray mod from Minecraft. I'm sure a lot of you guys have experienced the X-Ray mod. Um, but that's what this game reminds me of. Alright, I think I'm supposed to go this way. Let's do another burst. Burst scan. This is a really cool game. I love finding, like, unique games like this. Like, this is what indie games are all about. Doing something different. <laughs> and this is definitely different. Whoa, okay. Jump over here. I wonder what would happen if you fell down. I wonder if I would die. I mean, I'm sure I would. But wh where would it like... Is there like checkpoints? I guess there are checkpoints. Every so often I see a little thing that looks like a loading thing. Probably a checkpoint. Yeah. But I just aren't a checkpoint there. Burst scan. Whoa. This is getting crazy. Whoa. What am I even looking at? <laughs> This is so cool. Whoa. Alright. I think I have to jump over here? I'm trying to be careful because I'm pretty sure I can fall. What's in here? Can I climb this? No, definitely not. Alright, so I need to go this way. Oh, this is cool. Okay, so I'm entering some sort of vault, it looks like. The temple must have been over a thousand years old. I'm in the temple. Okay, cool. I knew they existed. I'd searched for the cultist all my life. There's like trees in here. To finally see it in person, to be the first. Oh, there's a shrine. Oh, more shrines. <laughs> this is really, really cool. I like this. 
Is that a hand? Oh my god. It's like giant. Oh wait, never mind. It's a statue. I thought that was an actual person. <laughs> I was like gonna say, there's like giants down here. More statues. Scan. Here they perform sacrifices. The more I scanned around the altar, the more it revealed. I guess. Uh, I guess I'm not supposed to be over here. Alright, there's another item I can pick up. Uh oh. Uh oh. Whoa, like I just fell off. Map view. Press back to view map. Back. Whoa. Wow. Holy crap. That is cool. <laughs> That's a cool looking map. That is awesome. They need to have maps like this in like AAA games. Like this looks really cool. You can actually see like exactly where you went. You can actually like sort of backtrack and see everything. That's awesome. I always wondered how many poor bastards they threw over the edge. Oh, I just fell on the edge. Crap. Oops. <laughs> um. Okay, I'm gonna have to do that again. I didn't mean to fall. I kind of slipped. What does that say? Chasm 9000 burst scan. Okay, so I'm currently prison 1, prison 2, prison 3, prison 4, prison 5, huh? Wait, map view. Oh. Wait, I'm here. And apparently, maybe I need to go down there? Oh, crap. Maybe I'm supposed to explore other places. Oh, there's a... Ooh. I should be doing the burst scan more often, but... I don't think it's really necessary most of the time. Kind of a spooky game. Their victims were doomed to relive their final tortured hours forever. No wonder people went mad down here. This could make for like a great horror game. Like, could you imagine if something was like stalking you while you were down here? And you don't even know like where you're going, and it's like pitch black. It's hard to make out where exactly I'm supposed to go. I'm just like sort of following the edges and seeing if there's anything. There's a door here. I'm not going through like a big maze. Let me do the skin. Oh, there's a chair. Oh wow, you can actually make out the furniture and stuff. Alright, I'm gonna keep going. I wanna I wanna know what's down this rabbit hole. How far it goes. I mean, it's basically just a walking simulator, you're just walking, but the style of the game, like, the way the map reveals itself is just really cool. The cultist slept and ate here. Okay. Like, the monks who came after, they spent their time in silent prayer to an unanswering god. I'm supposed to go this way, I think.
do another burst scan. Kind of want to know what's in here. Ooh, is that a treasure chest? I guess I can't pick that up. All right. Um, where am I supposed to go? Oh, this way. This like goes on forever. <laughs> this is like one super freaking long tunnel, basically. It'd be funny, like, you get to it like a point and then you're just like, oh crap, now I have to get back. I'm gonna starve to death. <laughs> then you have to go like all the way back. Alright, let's do the scanner. this. Oh. Man, I really wish I could see. I wish I could take off the uh, visor. Looks like we're in some sort of, like, underground well. Like, just water dripping, I guess? This is cool. I'm guessing there's just water on the ground. It's flat, and I can hear water. Someone needs to play this game blindfolded. I think that'd be a cool experience. All right, let's go this way. Oh, I'm in the water. Uh-oh. 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 Uh -oh. Uh-oh. Holy crap. <laughs> I couldn't use my scanner while while swimming. Holy crap. Okay. Um What exactly am I looking at? Wait, am I supposed to go this way? The witch trials came much later. And this game is kind of spooky. Uh oh. They used to drag witches down here and purge them in huge numbers, evil throughout the ages. Oh shit. Oh no. Oh no. There's something over there. They wanted to imprison the evil down here as eternal punishment. I think I need to go this way. Oh crap, this is... Oh shit. This is kind of scary. Like, I feel like something's gonna pop up grab me. Crap. I think I need to go this way, but... Oh, shit! Oh, crap! Oh, crap! Oh, crap! Oh, no! <laughs> oh, my God. I knew that was gonna happen. Oh wow, okay, so you actually can die in this game. I didn't I didn't know this was like a horror game. So how how exactly am I supposed to do this? So 
So I'm guessing I'm supposed to like... What's, what's over this way? I don't really scan over this way yet. I don't think there's anything over there. Can I climb this? Oh, I can. I'm not sure if I was supposed to do that. Oh. Oh, crap. Oh, shit. I definitely don't think I'm supposed to do that. I don't think I can get back now. I think I'm gonna have to die. Unless I can just jump around, maybe? Alright, let's do a scan. I'm dead. I'm dead. Shit! I think I might be out of the map. Oh shit! Oh shit! Here it comes! This is... this is nuts. This is absolutely nuts. Alright, and we'll try this again. Um, oh, there's a path over here. Maybe not. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, this is absolutely crazy. Um, alright, so here's the plan. I think I'm supposed to jump over here, and then I'm supposed to, I'm supposed to probably swim across and get to that platform over there before the witch comes after me. So I'm gonna have to, like, do this fast. Or I can just jump, maybe jump on top of here. Yeah, that makes things a little bit easier. There we go. But where do I go from here? Shoot. Was I supposed to come over here? I'm thinking like maybe there's another route. I mean... I would have to make it like to that other side without the witch getting me. Go, 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 go! Screw you, rich witches! Screw you! <laughs> oh, I guess I made it. Wow. I did wonder if it was a true... Of course, no way these were just glitches. <laughs> yeah, these aren't glitches. What are you guys talking about? A freaking cave. That much death occurring in such a confined space. What horrors must they have seen in their final moments? Oh man, I'm not going on the water again, no way. Maybe I have to. I'm thinking maybe I have to run across again. I don't know if the witches are here. Whoa. There's cages. I think I'm going the right way. It just goes on and on and on. Whoa. Okay. Where now? Down here. This game is definitely super interesting. Well, I like this game for sure. Oh, I must have gone the wrong way. Yeah. There was a split and I was supposed to go right. I wonder if you fall off, like, oh man, yeah, there's like things in the water. <laughs> I bet if you like fall off, something will grab you. Is 
such an interesting game. Uh-oh. Not sure if I'm supposed to go this way. Probably not. I just want to see what's over here. Yeah, I just, yeah, definitely not supposed to go this way. So either left or right. I think we're supposed to go right. That's my guess, anyway. And maybe we're supposed to swim over there? I don't think I was supposed to come this way, unfortunately. But I think there might be a way to get across. If I just book it, maybe I can get there. Go, 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 go! Made it. Alright, I'm here. Since the upgrade, the scanner resolution has been increased. Sweet. So that means I can probably go wider. Oh man, this game freaking me out. We'll go around. Oh, the never ending journey through the cave. Uh oh. A little bit of platforming. I swear, if I start getting chased, I'm just gonna shut this game off. <laughs> oh. Be absolutely horrifying getting chased through this. Cave. There's a boat here. Uh oh. Crap. The game. I mean, my computer is messing up. It's not the game. Like, every time you see like a lag spike, it's not the game. It's my computer. Alright, there we go. All I have to do is push forward. This is really cool. I cannot believe I'm on like a raft. This is like, it's almost like a magical game. Like all these colors everywhere. This is like so beautiful, so vibrant. Even though it's just like shades of red, yellow, and green, and blue, it still looks. Oh crap. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I feel like I'm on like um, one of those like lazy rivers in like Disney World or like Six Flags and stuff. That's what it, that's what this feels like. There's like fish in the water, I think. There's like something moving. Yeah, I think they're like fish. Well, this is cool.
Oh wow, you can actually see the water if you stop um, scanning. That's really cool. I mean, I could turn off the scanner, by the way. I've just been holding it down, just so I can always see what's coming up in front of me. Is this the end of the game? This might be the end of the game. This is such a beautiful game. Like, look at this. This is cool. Start scanning again. It's really like interesting, like the more you scan, like the more detail that you see, the more the world comes to life. Alright, well, the music's gone, which is kind of unfortunate. Now it's just very eerie music. Oh, now it's starting to get creepy again. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh, it's starting to get creepy. Really fast, I want to check the map. Look at, oh my god, look at how big the map is. Look at how far I've traveled. From all the way up there, all the way to here. That's crazy. I lost all my speed. Damn it. I wonder what, what's at the end of this cave. Like, is there just gonna be like some giant that eats me or something? That's what I feel like. I think we're almost at the end. I think there, there has to be something at the very end here. Yeah, some sort of door. How did this raft end up down here? Alright. Back on our feet again. Uh oh. me? I don't know if you can kill me or not. Material scanner, press X to switch to sensor mode. Oh. So many have died down here. The miners that came for work, they were just as suspicious they were terrified of this place. What's that? Oh, miner is falling. All those that lost their lives to negligence, something, something, I don't know. Alright, some people died.
I really don't understand the purpose of switching to a different mode. I guess it's just different colors. I guess it might be easier. I don't know. I think it's just to mix things up a little bit. Something up here. I'm gonna hear something. This cave over here. Man, this, this is a long game. I was expecting this to be like an hour or so, but it's turning out to be something far more than that. Um, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. Oh, I don't think I was supposed to fall. I didn't mean to. Mod, oh, never mind. Yeah, I definitely didn't mean to do that. But we didn't lose very much progress, so it's okay. It's okay. I don't know what's over there. So, basically there's a bridge on the ceiling and I need to find a way up. Oh, there's a staircase here. I didn't even see that staircase. Alright, almost there. Does it matter that all of this is in my memory? What? Does it make... Does it make it any less real? Hmm. Alright, we're gonna have to go across this. I was there. I was the first. Whoa. I was afraid to jump. Definitely like one of the best exploration adventure games I've played this year. Otherwise known as walking simulators. Because all you do is walk. Uh, but anyways, I'm trying to make my way to the end of this. It's gone on for way too long. I'm so deep. I'm so deep. sort of switch. I remember coming down like it was yesterday. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to go this way. Hoping I'd find something below, hoping it wouldn't be another empty cave. Alright, there's some sort of puzzle going on. Just wish I'd be... Oh, I just wish I'd been better prepared. Okay, um, some sort of puzzle. Is there something? Oh, there's a little cave, I think.
So it's kind of cool. This like other vision sort of tells you where to go. I think. I don't know. Maybe not. No idea where I'm going. Yeah, this has to be the right way, right? Did I just go in the wrong way the entire time? I'm gonna scan one more time. Just trying to get a better sense of where... I think I'm supposed to go this way. Yeah, I just got a checkpoint. It looks like... I am... Oh, over here? Holy crap, that kind of scared me. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have to come back here and like ride the elevator up. Maybe, maybe not. This is crazy, crazy, crazy. Again, I apologize for all the like lag spikes. That's my computer. It's not the game. It just I've been having issues recording with uh, OBS Studio with the Windows Creators Update. Um. Especially windowed games, so yeah, unfortunately Nothing I can do about it right now What's this? I haven't been here All right, so there's another button So, from what I'm seeing here, I think I need to drop down, and I need to find a way up. Yeah, there we go. And now, after pressing this button, I should activate the lift. I feel like Indiana Jones right now. <laughs> uh, or like Tomb Raider.
How many times do I have to relive this? All right, let me check the map. I I'm curious to know. All right, so I rode this lift all the way up. It looks like I'm almost to the surface. I have to be to the surface because I started out like way over there in the corner. So it seems like I'm going back to the surface. Maybe that's what I'm doing, okay. Always the same rock, the same metal, the same stale air. I must be getting close to the surface, right? And the guilt. Yeah, this is the exit. I'm outside now, almost. Uh, the game just froze. Oh, there we go. I just want to see my family again. I'm outside. Yeah, I'm outside the cave. I don't know how I died. Yeah, this is definitely outside. How do I get my VR headset off? <laughs> All the memories I'm forced to relive, it's the one thing I don't remember. I feel like I'm about to get killed, but it breaks my heart knowing that I left my family behind. There's my family. They are always here for me. They know I'm never coming back. This must be the ending. For some reason I feel like there's going to be like a jump scare at the end. <laughs> Throughout the entire game it felt like 
there's gonna be like something chasing after me or trying to kill me, but for the most part, that never happened, except in the water, like the water section, but uh, I don't know, just the sounds, the ambient sounds, just uh, it always made me like on edge, feeling like there was something out there trying to get me. <laughs> But definitely not really a horror game. It just kind of feels like a horror game. Almost like a psychological horror. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Is it not over? Oh shit. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, that was a pretty cool ending. I like that ending. Um, so, like, my interpretation of it, basically you play as, like, a miner, a miner's soul, who basically discovered something, like, deep down in a mine, and apparently you died, and your soul is, like, stuck there forever. something killed you I guess the witches the witches killed you <laughs> but um yeah um, I guess I guess that's pretty much it this is uh, a really interesting game I would highly recommend playing this I played through the entire thing it probably took like two hours I'm not really sure yet um, it was made by the same people who made prison architect which is a really good game really surprised to see this come from the creators of Prison Architect, but uh, definitely like A plus for an exploration adventure game. This is top of the line. Um, loved the visuals. Some parts, some sections were so beautiful. Going through on the raft, that was amazing. Um, really interesting story. Really creepy atmosphere. Uh, almost borderline horror and I thought it was really cool. So anyways, I beat the game. I'm really happy that I played through it. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check this out. Make sure you like wishlist it as well if you guys um, are just waiting for a sale or something. Really, really cool game. Um, but yeah, there'll be a link in the description below to the Steam Store page. And besides that, thanks for watching and have a nice day.